In today's video, we're looking at 10 of the best free tools and add-ons available online. Some of those might help you create entire worlds, others are there to make your work easier. So, let's see what we have. And if we missed any tool you have in mind, please comment down below so we spread the joy. We do also have a playlist of over 300 free add-ons for you to get, so hit the like button and let's start. At number one, we have the Minecraft World Generator, a free tool from Blender Procedural to help you generate a complete Minecraft world inside Blender. This free add-on allows you with just a few clicks to generate plants and animals with the ability to change the height, size, and seed of your 3D world. Available on the market for free, super easy to use, with tons of variations and details to get you satisfied, so give it a try. Next in line we have Polycam a free AI texture generator that works like magic for anyone into 3D modeling, gaming, or animation. It can turn your creative ideas into reality by generating incredibly realistic textures based on a simple text prompt. The textures you get from Polycam are free and ready to be imported directly into Blender. With all the work you generate being royalty-free, that means commercial use is all for you to do. So visit the site and start creating. This can be perfect for video games environment, VR experiences, and 3D digital art. The site is fast and with direct downloads, so might help you create that Super Mario project you've been dreaming about. At number three, we have Ragdoll, a real-time physics solver for animators. Ragdoll monitors your animation and provides you with a preview of what it would look like if you let physics take the wheel. Available online for free, and you have multiple tutorials to get the base of it. This can take your craft to a new level and help you create amazing rig work with no time. So get the add-on, visit the channel for more info, and start animating. Next, we have this Ivy Generator Pro add-on for Blender, which allows you to draw Ivy on any surface. Available on Gum Road for free by now, so try to have it sooner than later if you're into grass. Works with the Draw tool, so just go with the one you like and start drawing on any area, and it's compatible with both Eevee and Cycles, so it can't be easier than this. Have fun. If you want to create a bridge between faces or punch a hole in a mesh with ease, the Sculpt Bridge tool is here for you, and it's free. You're probably familiar with the default bridge tool. However, this one will take your work to a new level. There's a full explanation on how to use this tool in full details available on the main site, with couple of info you need to pay attention to regarding symmetry and the operation system. 
so visit the author page on Gumroad and give it a try. At number six, we have RePrimitive, a Blender add-on that allows you to tweak primitives whenever you want without creating them from scratch. RePrimitive works despite the object location or rotation, and it even works if you applied the transformation. You can find all the info on GitHub and it's free, so if you need it, you know where to find it. Next in line, we have the Easy Fog 2 from AltTab. This add-on makes adding clouds, smoke, and all sorts of foggy effects to your scenes a breeze. You can drop in presets and tweak them without breaking a sweat. This one is on the free and paid side, so you get a free demo version with like 10% of the main add-on unlocked to try it out. Then if you're into it, you might put a ring on it, or your card info, that works too. But it's still cool to try it out, cause who doesn't like smoke vibes? Just a heads up, those add-ons can be a bit heavy for low-res machines, so go with caution. Now before we continue, we have two honorable mentions. First one is the Gradient Sampler. Sounds sus, and indeed it is a cool way to create color ramps just by stroking over a reference image. It also supports sampling gradients from other applications like Pure Ref, so it might be helpful if you are a node geek. The second tool we have is the Little Arrows, which gives you the ability to change to previous or next material using arrow buttons instead of the drop-down assignment window. Both tools are available for free and you can get them from the description links. Last on this video, we have some great news and update on the Graswald Vegetation Library. A huge amount of the premium assets have been made available for free on the site, and for the one that are new to the G-Scatter and Graswald, this is one of the best add-ons to make your environment look realistic. Nothing more to say, visit the site to explore it and have fun. And that's it. Subscribe because your grandma already did, so you kinda late bud, and see you in another video. Stay sharp. Goodbye.